I love mushrooms, especially all red and white ones, and I have always felt like a magical fairy spirit by nature. So get ready with me this Halloween as I become my mushroom magical self. My name is Heather Lynn, and I am the Wild Woodland Witch. I practice wild folk magic, and I am obsessed with all things that live in the forest. So let's play, watch me get ready as I become, and go through this transformation. I wanted to share this transformation with you and wish you all a very blessed and magical Samhain. And my loves, happy Halloween. So in the true spirit of my costume, for this Samhain or Halloween, I have found a treasure. Are you out here, two wild ones, embracing the season of the witch? There was a time in my life where I let the natural world and all of its tiny details pass me by. And I truly regret the years I felt I was too busy for my witch life, to take time for me to connect, to build my relationship to the land. This year has been full of vulnerability and lots and lots and lots of harvesting and connecting. I love mushrooms, as you can tell, and I wanted to share my collection with you all. Is it all witches? Or is it just me, this obsession with mushrooms? Either way, I start collecting midsummer and eventually end up with a collection that I dry and preserve with a spray for wildflowers. And I'll link that product name below for you should you be inspired to gather the last of the mushrooms as I am right now. There is still time, you haven't missed it. In fact, you haven't missed a thing. You are right where you need to be, doing right what you should be doing. And if you're not, you know it. <laughs> and it's not too late to shift your spiral round. Transformation is challenging, but it's also this journey that is deeply rewarding. And speaking of transformation, one of the most powerful tools that I have in my witch's toolbox is my wand. And these wands were made for some witches that I know were on my Instagram. And I just loved crafting them. And I just love crafting in general, so I was really excited to share them with you. This 
this was just a short video to send my love to you on my favorite, favorite holiday on the witch's wheel. I love dressing up. <laughs> I love the art of pretend. And I love the element of hiding. Isn't it fun just to decide to be something else or to try on what it might be like to be something else? For me, it's mushrooms this year. And I wonder what my next costume will be. And I'll tell you one thing, it won't be next year. <laughs> I like to dress up all year long. It's kind of a hobby of mine to play into, it's part of my magic, to play into what it's like to feel like to be, say for example, moss or um, the forest floor. I like to try and live into the feelings and emotions and the power behind each element in the forest. Actually, I will link above a video that I um, did on my embrace with moss. But either way, I, I just wanted to pause for a moment and just say that um, this kind of art of pretend can happen all year long. And in fact, it's kind of, for me, it's method acting, you know, it's, it's tapping into, it's like wearing someone else's shoes, if you've ever heard that um, analogy. When I'm trying to get to know materials in the forest for wild magic, I have to have an empathic kind of approach to working my magic. So I often will play or try on a costume which emulates that element or that material and so yeah just an idea for us why not st why stop at Halloween we can we can live into fantasy all year long anyway that's my take on it blessings to your magic this Samhain and my dears, this is a time of year that can be challenging for us all because the winter is coming. But just as we're vulnerable, we need to go through that process, that unfolding. And it might be scary for some or anxiety may come up for others. But in the end, the transformation will come. The growth will be achieved. Everything we're feeling now, if we're feeling challenged by this time, will fade. Because we go round and round and round again. The spring will emerge, the summer too, the fall again, and winter. And round and round and round we go. And so my dears, blessings to your magic this Samhain, and I'll see you soon. Come and find me again.